guys i am your host snigdho and i will tell you about scrum and its related tools let's get going scrum is an agile process framework for controlling complex knowledge work with an initial emphasis on software development though it has been used in other fields and is slowly starting to be explored for other complex work research and advanced technologies Open MRS, which is an open source medical record system helping hospitals in many countries to overcome medical software problem, also uses Scrum for developing the software. Our next topic is Scrum Master. The Scrum Master is a servant leader for the Scrum team. The Scrum Master helps those outside the Scrum team understand which of their interactions with the scrum team are helpful and which are not the scrum master helps everyone change these interactions to maximize the value created by the scrum team now let's see what scrum team is a scrum team is a collection of individuals typically between five and nine members working together to deliver the required product increments. The Scrum framework encourages a high level of communication among team members so that the team can follow a common goal. Our next topic is Scrum Sprint. Scrum Sprint is a repeatable fixed time box during which a done product of the highest possible value is created. Sprint lies at the core of the Sprint Agile methodology and can be thought of as an event which wraps all other Scrum events like Daily Scrums, Scrum Review and Sprint Retrospective. We will talk about two backlogs. One is Scrum Product Backlog and Another is Sprint Backlog. Let's see the first one. Scrum Product Backlog is simply a list of all things that needs to be done within the project. It replaces the traditional requirements specification artifacts. These items can have a technical nature or can be user-centric. For example, in the form of user storage. Sprint Backlog is the set of product backlog items selected for the sprint, plus a plan for delivering the product increment and realizing the sprint goal. The Sprint Backlog is a forecast by the development team about what functionality will be in the next increment and the work needed to deliver that functionality into a done increment. Previously, we mentioned the word increment. Let's find out what it is. The increment is the sum of all the product backlog items completed during a sprint and the value of the increments of all previous sprints. At the end of a sprint, the new increment must be done, which means it must be in usable condition and meet the Scrum team's definition of done our final topic is the difference between sprint review and sprint retrospective these two almost look like same but there is difference sprint review is a collaborative meeting between the product owner team scrum master and other stakeholders the sprint review is equivalent to a user acceptance test it is where the project team demonstrates the results of the work that they have done in the sprint and the product owner and any required stakeholders accept the work or not in the screen we can see what is done after a meeting of a sprint they, they discuss about done functionalities updated product backlogs etc Sprint Retrospective is a collaborative meeting between the product owner, team, and Scrum Master. It is like a project, project post-mortem, but that is done at the end of a sprint. The, the aim of the meeting is to reflect the workflow in the previous sprint and regulate how it can be improved in the next sprint. In the screen, we can see the QA that are generally discussed. 
we can finally say that in sprint review the result of a task is discussed and in sprint retrospective the past and the future are discussed that's all for today thank you very much